Good afternoon, everyone. This is acrylic pour number seven, making art in memory of Abby and Libby. This is Libby. This is Abby. Happy birthday to everyone that has a birthday today. I've scraped this canvas. It just didn't work out. I'm going to attempt an acrylic pour with single colors so I just have an elevation here of just a cap from you know a bottle of paint I'm gonna hold the colander all right I'm gonna start I've mixed everything I'm starting with the blue now I've taken my cups I've cut them down just so the paint doesn't have far to travel I do have the hair serum Here's the hair serum in not the white, but not the metallics, only the colors, the blue, the green. The red and the tan color are metallic. All right, here we go. add some white sorry on the edges all right here we go blue white Let's see if it's coming out red white some green I've mixed that green with many different greens a teal metallic The white the tan metallic tan metallic I've only mixed a little bit of the tan the red and a light blue which is the darker blue mixed with some white Let's see how we're doing here whoops so I do use these spoon straws which I really like all right hmm, interesting I'm gonna turn this gonna do is put this back on and add some more of the blue whoops put it back on add a little bit more of the green and tilt it to the side there and maybe I can get some of this red out some of the white into the red all right it's not quite a colander for what I expected but that's okay okay I'm gonna tilt this pick up Take this off. 
going to see what I want to keep. I think a little disappointed about the red. I might just have to drizzle this on, unfortunately. So this is like, hmm, interesting. My way of using up some of the paints. I'm going to take my nice little tool that I like, this hairbrush thingy. Just going to do that. going to wipe it off. I'm going to do that again the other way. I wipe it off in between. And I just want to create something in the middle. Try to get some of this. You know what? Let me torch this while I'm waiting. I'm going to add some of the paint to the edges. I'm going to wipe off my tool and I'm just going to take this. There we go. Just take some of the pink and just drizzle it some more. I kind of like that in the middle there. It's actually supposed to be metallic but I'm not sure what's happening it doesn't seem to be coming up metallic oh that is pretty all right so I'm just gonna take my tool very gently or it's almost like on the top I'm just gonna take a little bit of this and maybe a little bit more there I'm probably gonna leave it now Let's see, I'm going to turn my turntable, make sure I have the edges covered. I'm going to torch it again. See, I like the spoon straws because you can scoop up some of the colors and just drip it over the edge. It's really great. All right, so now I got smart and I covered my torch with the press and seal so now that I have paint on my hands and I touch this it's not going to get paint all over and make it look real sloppy so I'm going to torch this let me see if I okay it's good Let me take a look and even the drippings let me turn this so you can see how pretty the drippings are and you could save that for later to make a skin and make some jewelry I am going to pick this up just a little bit and see whoops about maybe taking some of this going to go over and back, over and back. I kind of want to, whoops, look at that. And one more time with the reddish, just dripping on more on this side.
and just taking my tool again very lightly very just barely touching the surface and I think just get a little bit more again my spoon straw which is wonderful take very lightly there we go I think it might just bring this down a little bit and maybe this up here there we go and a little bit here and one more time just move it around and get that pink flowing through really pretty go this is the 8x8 canvas thank you for watching I really appreciate it subscribe and like and I'll see you next time bye bye